Thanks, Ramiko. Switching gears now, the premier of Turks and Caicos, the Honorable Charles Washington Mizik, touching down on Grand Bahama this past weekend to host a cocktail reception for the Grand Bahama TCI diaspora. The Turks leader addressing attendees and extending an open invitation for those within the diaspora to return to their ancestral roots. Our Aja Quant was there and has more in this report. Scores of persons within the Turks and Caicos diaspora gathering here at the Grand Tokayan Ballroom for what they call a significant event. Premier of the Turks and Caicos Islands, the Honorable Charles Washington Mizik, extending a welcome hand to those persons, noting that they can return home at any time. Premier Mizik has returned to Grand Bahama for the first time in 30 years and claims that a lot has changed since then. He adds that he is surprised at the number of persons turning out for the diaspora reception and says their government remains committed to working with the Bahamas government to continue building a stronger relationship between both countries. The truth of the matter is the Bahamas and the Turks and Caicos Islands are not only neighbors, we are friends. And we are relatives. The bloodlines are very close. And I'm discovering that more and more as the relationship is deepened. Her Excellency Anya Williams, the Deputy Governor of the Turks and Caicos Islands, also expressing gratitude on behalf of the TCI government for the work and assistance they've received from the Bahamas government. Both Premier and Deputy Governor says their country is doing well. However, they believe it can be better if persons with roots from the country can be at the forefront of that growth. We are embarking on major change in the public service and in the private sector. There's a number of projects in the pipeline, and we're encouraging as many persons that would like to, to return home and to be a part of that development. I don't want to intrude on the good will of, of the Bahamas, but I made a joke to my Bahamian uh, political um, colleague the other day and told him, if you don't behave yourself, I'm going to take all of my people back home. <laughs> <laughs> Minister for Grand Bahama, the Honorable Ginger Moxie, also in attendance expressing her delight for the visit, adding her excitement that both countries remain strong partners, particularly because of the rich history. On the island of Grand Bahama, the plan to develop and establish our nation's second city would not have been possible without the contributions of the many <laughs> Turks Islanders who were recruited to join the workforce which was spearheaded by the architects of the city of Freeport. This evening's reception in honor of the Turks and Caicos Islands diaspora honors the legacy of the Turks Islanders who labored beside Bahamians to build Freeport and the countless others who contributed their efforts to the development of islands throughout the Bahamas. Premier Mizik says the TCI hospitality sector is growing and there are hundreds of jobs in the public sector. However, housing remains an issue in the country, but an open invitation for those with ancestral roots remain. For the Bahamas Tonight, the Northern Edition, I'm Azure Quant.